All right. So what I wanted to do was make a video to kind of show everybody where I am with my T-Rex uh, painting here of the model kit. First of all, I hit the belly with uh, a little bit of white, uh, just Tamiya flat white paint. I'll spin him around a little bit so everyone can see that he's fairly even on both sides. Just to note, this model kit was a pain in the butt to put together because it was vinyl and uh, vinyl sometimes doesn't fit very well. Anyway, after that I used I'll show you the color here, up close. I use that color as my base. And then I dusted it on. What I learned between the last time I did it and this time is to not apply it so heavy even though it's a base coat because underneath was white primer. So I kind of hit it, you know, with more intensity in different spots than others. Uh, so I got a nicer effect with it this time. And then what I did is I mixed it with a little bit of black, just a little bit. And as you can see, a little bit on the top, I kind of hit it on the top and across the middle a little bit with the darker color, just to kind of make it look more realistic. And then I mixed it was a little bit of white and I went over some spots again, kind of pulled it back with both of those colors, just kind of misted it a little bit. So, and then I went back today and I touched it up with some more white. So it's coming along nicely. Um, but now I'm kind of at the same point where I was last time, uh, which is getting to the hard part. I'm not really skilled enough yet with uh, an airbrush you know, to get the fine lines, like I want the lines to be really fine. I think what I'm going to do is, um, I'm going to do yellow and black lines, probably yellow with like, um, a black line around the yellow, you know, maybe a little bit extreme for somebody who's not that good at painting yet. Anyway, what I'm going to do before then, and I thought I'd just show you guys, is I've got my little mixer down here, and I took some, uh, what color is this, burnt sienna, and I mixed it with that base coat color that I showed you, kind of add a little bit of red tinge to it, just a little more, so it's a little late tonight, so I'm not going to do that, but tomorrow I'm going to hit that, kind of mist it over, um, a little bit and see how that works out and then near the top of the T-Rex I'm also going to hit it with this uh, this uh, burnt sienna or sorry burnt umber uh, well doesn't want to doesn't really want to come in very well probably because Yeah, anyway, so I'm going to do those two colors over it just to kind of give it a little more contrast because I think that that would make it look a little more realistic. And then after that, I'll probably film another short video just showing you what it looks like after that. And then I'm going to try the hard part, which is to make my yellow and black lines. That's the part I probably will try and do it with a brush and then I will try to do a wash possibly, and some dry brushing to blend those uh, stripes in uh, with my base coat.